Some employees in Cambria County tell us they're unhappy after hearing about 350 of their co-workers received big pay raises last week. Maria Miller spent the day at the courthouse trying to find answers. Maria? Well, Jen, on January 1st, Cambria County union employees received their previously negotiated pay increase, while non-union members received a flat 2% raise. For supervisors and managers, though, who don't fall under either category and typically don't receive a year-to-year -year pay raise, they got their own surprise. What we were trying to do was, more than anything, correct inverted pay scales. An inverted pay scale meaning that your boss is being paid less than the people that are working for the boss. We found many of the raises are one to $5,000 a piece and are going to a wide variety of positions, but primarily those within the courts. While well, the commissioners told us the raises were not chosen on an individual basis, President Judge Timothy Creaney admits it's something he advocated for. Some line officers were earning more than super Supervisors and there's little incentive to keep the good people uh, who are supervising the cases uh, in those positions. There, there's more responsibility, there's less pay. Doesn't make sense. If you tally the raises, they total more than $260,000. So we wanted to know how can a county already facing major budget issues and a county that had to take out a loan to make it through 2013 afford nearly a quarter of a million dollars worth of pay increases. We have had some financial help uh, with the judicial side. Special funds, Creaney says, were created years ago that generate money mostly through fines and assessments made from criminal cases. So it's not coming out of uh, taxes, it's not coming out of the general uh, public's pockets. Now, to be clear, the only raises the county is receiving help with are those positions on the judicial side. The others, Langenfelder says, were all included in the budget and voted on in December. Reporting live, Maria Miller, 6 News.